use the water in the shower. Like and even when I was complaining, like they coming in there tearing my room up, getting mad. I'm like, how y'all mad at the conditions y'all got us living in? We already in jail. Mm -hmm. But how would you expect jail to be? You know, it's jail. Like don't what they tell you, like, don't come here. It ain't gonna be a suite. It ain't gonna be a hotel. So I'm like, you know, I took that in consideration. Like, you're right. I should still humans, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they don't care. I, I definitely like uh, the features that you got on it, Rilo. I like the record with Meek. Talk to me about that and any conversation that you guys shared. And tell them the truth guys... what you said. Huh? As a woman, tell them what you didn't like. All right, I ain't really. Damn, man, you really be doing too much. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what you didn't like. like. I think it's a song with Meek, or maybe it's a song after, but you're like, no, uh, me. shut up. It's Meek. It's like, um, yeah, I f that bitch. And we f that bitch. Yeah, we f that bitch. You mad? We f that bitch. You know what I'm saying? That sounds crazy coming from hey, you. When she said that, I said, you're going to be really mad when you hear Doug say he don't f nobody girl no more. You f their mom. Their mama's. <laughs> I was just like, all right, this is a lot. That That's all, but. I mean, we was geeked up, man. We was, we was just in that, you know what I'm saying? It was like one of them up tempo beats, so I'm just in there going like, "How you mad at me? She? F How you mad at me? He? F you know what I'm saying? It wasn't really none towards no, no particular girl. But well, that's a good question. Why you mad now? So I just don't love it. I don't want to hear it. Why you on switch it up? Why you mad at me? He f I hear what you're saying. <laughs> I, I, I get the bars. I get it. Do you hate the internet, man? I don't want to say I hate it. I just probably hate how it's used. Because it seems like every so often they come at you about something. Like the last thing I saw was... I don't know. What's that beef with me? You, <laughs> you was out playing with your daughter and they started saying you and your daughter was the same height. Yeah, like... I don't, see, I don't, I don't really get too mad at that type of stuff. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't jokes. get mad at jokes at all. Mm -hmm. I just get mad at like the... The, the foul love, like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? A joke is a joke. Like, mm -hmm. I can take a joke, any joke, really. Mm -hmm. Now you said that the, the beats in hip hop have declined. You think you think producers are are not making beats so good caliber anymore? Yeah, I feel like they ain't trying. Like I remember we used to go to the studio. It used to take us like two, three, two, three beats. We picking the song, and it almost probably gonna be a hit. Like now we in there listening for an hour, two hours, just going to. And it's just like, man, I feel like I did good though. Mm -hmm. as far as, you got some jam. As far as my take, like, I feel like I always do you good. You pick, you pick right one. But it took me longer than it usually take me. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully it get better. I see, I see Gotti's not on the album. Gotti ain't wanna, Gotti ain't wanna rap no more. Is Gotti done done? No, I want that. Mm. I feel like Gotti always gonna be, you know, mm. with me. I like, he will never, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just was, I had so many other songs featured, bro. It was hard narrowing this song, this stuff down, cause I don't be like them put that many songs out, cause I be like, bro, they gonna skip over these songs. I'm gonna be mad, like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Other people probably be having bigger songs than me on their tape, but Gotti was telling me like, by you putting out good music, your tape be on the charts a lot longer, mm -hmm. like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. I just wanna make good music instead of big songs. Amen. Did you see, uh, I, I gotta ask because you're from Detroit. Did you see Skiller Baby say that most people in Detroit wouldn't say Eminem is the best rapper yeah, from Detroit? I ain't seen him say that, but that's probably how they feel. Mm -hmm. You know, Skiller Baby also said something else, and you said something earlier that made me think about it, about the, uh, the, a Detroit rapper, like becoming that next, next person. Yeah. And he said he don't feel like, uh, Detroit rappers are as consistent as they should be. You feel that way? Yeah, but bro, I don't know if people know how hard it is to get a banger, like, it's, it ain't that easy. Like, these people try. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. feel like they dropping the music. It just ain't connecting. Like, mm -hmm. it just ain't a big song. Like. That was part two of our interview with 4-2 Doug. Now keep it locked. We got eight more joints to count down. And just with the mess is coming up, it's Weekends with the Breakfast Club. More, more Weekends with the Breakfast Club up next.